Jennifer Coolidge and co-star Aubrey Plaza led the glamour rivals at the premiere for The White Lotus Season 2 in Los Angeles on Thursday night. The Emmy Award winner, 61, looked ultra busty in a black lace nude illusion dress with a sweetheart neckline. The sexy number clung tightly to her curvaceous figure as she posed for shutterbugs on the red carpet. Coolidge's shiny blonde hair was worn in a voluminous style that cascaded down her chest in loose curls. The star, who plays heiress Tanya McQuaid, completed the look with a pair of strappy black heels. Coolidge cheeks were dusted with a vibrant pink blush and shimmering bronze eyeshadow was swiped across her lids. Back in September, Coolidge took home the Emmy Award for Supporting Actress in a Limited or Anthology series for her work on the hit HBO show. Plaza looked red hot as she arrived to the event in a racy scarlet gown that flattered her fit figure. The Parks and Rec Hallam sizzling dress was a one-shoulder design with cutout below one breast. Her toned legs and strappy red heels poked out from a daring thigh slit. Plaza is one of season 2's new additions. She appeared in a trailer that debuted earlier this month as the newly married Harper. Rachel and husband Ethan Spiller are vacationing at the resort with their friends Cameron, Theo James, and Daphne Babcock, Megan Fahey, both looking as glamorous as ever. Plaza and Coolidge took the opportunity to join Forced on the red carpet. The dynamic duo got playful for the cameras with Plaza playing with her hair in one shot and Coolidge raising a celebratory hand in another. After getting in her solo glam shots, Coolidge was seen cozying up to co-star Murray Abraham. The Amadeus actor, 82, looked incredible for his age as he hit the red carpet in a blue satin bomber jacket and denim jeans. He styled his jacket and jeans with a sky blue v-neck shirt and a pair of Adidas sneakers. More videos 1, 2, 3 watch video Amanda Holden appears to have accidental nip slip watch video goggle box, Sophie Sandiford reacts to Liz Truss as Prime Minister watch video The Beckhams share glimpses from their family outing to Disney World watch video Courtney Kardashian bounces up and down for Lemmy Mach advert watch video The Crown teaser shows Diana in an intense car chase scene watch video Charlie Puth reveals he is in love with someone he grew up with watch video card DB is business chic as she departs Santa at a courthouse watch video Courtney Kardashian uses filer to give herself a lip piercing watch video Kim Kardashian in camo print at Babyface's album release party watch video Khloe Kardashian teases photo shoot for vitamin brand Lemmy watch video alleged footage of 14 year old convulsing on a bed before her death watch video thieves ransack family's home whilst they were out at dinner Sopranos star Michael Imperioli cut a stylish figure in a charcoal gray suit worn with a black button-up shirt and a black leather belt. His salt and pepper hair was softly slicked to one side. Imperioli plays the role of Dominic, who is the, the son Bert de Grasso, played by F. Murray Anderson. Dominic's own son, Alby, will be portrayed by actor Adam DiMarco. Maria Bakalova looked sweet in a quirky shift dress covered in pink and blue floral appliques. The actress wore her wavy blonde hair down and kept her makeup minimal as to showcase her natural beauty. Haley Lou Richardson, who plays Tanya McQuaid assistant Portia, brought some 60s flair in a colorful floral mini dress with a chest cutout and blue feather cuffs. The 27-year-old starlet styled her look with black go-go boots and she wore her cropped blonde hair straight. Sabrina Impaxiator took the plunge in an edgy black dress and matching leather gloves. The Italian star gave her petite frame a boost in a pair of silver platform heels. Megan Fahey wowed in a backless black gown that highlighted her slender frame. 
Her flowing golden hair was parted to one side and flowed down her back in voluminous waves. Her porcelain complexion was given a peach flush and her lips were painted a flattering mauve shade. Beatrice Grano cut a retro figure as she modeled a white tuxedo jacket with black velvet lapels and cuffs. The actress completed the look with a long silver neck scarf and flared velvet trousers. Theo James looked dapper in relaxed charcoal tone suit while posing with wife Ruth Carney. Carney stunned in a classic black dress with a matching shrug. Lucas Gage showcased his trendy style while rocking off white short sleeve button up shirt covered in blue decals. Season 2 of The White Lotus is available on HBO from Sunday, October 30th. More videos 1 2 3 Watch video Amanda Holden appears to have accidental nip slip Watch video Gogglebox, Sophie Sandiford reacts to Liz Truss as Prime Minister Watch video The Beckhams share glimpses from their family outing to Disney World Watch video Courtney Kardashian bounces up and down for Lemmy Mach advert Watch video The Crown teaser shows Diana in an intense car chase scene Watch video Charlie Puth reveals he is in love with someone he grew up with Watch video Cardi B is business chic as she departs Santa at a courthouse watch video Courtney Kardashian uses filer to give herself a lip piercing watch video Kim Kardashian in camo print at babyface's album release party watch video Khloe Kardashian teases photo shoot for vitamin brand Lemmy watch video moment woman pours glitter all over cheating partners house watch video how Ukrainian partisans wage their war against Russian collaborators the first season of the White Lotus feature featured a standout ensemble cast that included Murray Bartlett, Natasha Rothwell, Connie Britton, Coolidge, Alexandra Daddario, Jake Lacey, Brittany O'Grady and Sidney Sweeney. Steve Zahn, Lucas Gage, Fred Heckinger and Kakoa Kakumano and Molly Shannon also appeared. The show was the big winner at this year's Emmy Awards taking home an incredible 10 gongs, including outstanding limited or anthology series, 